So Salima bought some roses, tulips, and carnations. A quarter of them were roses, so that also means that the remaining three quarters were tulips and carnations. So then, if this is one quarter and this is three quarters, then the ratio of roses to tulips and carnations in total will be one to three. All right. While the remaining five twelve of the remainder were tulips and the remaining flowers were carnations. So out of out of the tulips and carnations, five twelve of them were tulips and the remaining seven twelve were carnations. So from here we see that the ratio of tulips to carnations will be five to seven. All right. Since we know that the number of tulips and carnations should be the same. Here we have five units plus seven units, which is twelve units. But here is only three, so we have to multiply the upper ratio by four. All right, and we have, can combine the ratio now. Three multiplying by four will give us twelve units, which is the same as five units plus seven units. So now we know that tulips to carnation will be seven five to seven. What the number of roses will have a ratio of four. So now we have the combined ratio of roses to tulips to carnations being 4 to 5 to 7. Alright? Then we know that each rose costs $2.50, each tulip costs $3, and each carnation costs $1.50. Selima spent a total of 142 on all the flowers. How many carnations did she buy? So from here, we know that she had 4 units of roses, 5 units of tulips, and 7 units of carnations. This is the number of flowers. So from 4 units of cut roses, each rose costs $2.50. This is the amount of money she spent on all the roses. For the tulips, she bought 5 units of tulips. Each tulip costs $3. Alright? And for the carnations, she bought 7 units, and each carnation cost her a dollar and fifty cents. So all these will add up to a total of one hundred and forty-two dollars. From here, if we work this out, we'll have a total of thirty-five point five units, which will be one hundred and forty-two dollars. So we see that one unit will be one hundred and forty-two dividing by thirty-five point five. So which gives us one unit will be four. So question is asking how many carnations did she buy? Carnations, we know there were 7 units. So we are finding what is 7 units. There will be 4 multiplying by 7, which gives us our answer of 7 carnation flowers.